Hello everyone. Uh, tonight I am going to show you how to burn a DVD with clone DVD in conjunction with any DVD. Okay. Just gonna pop the original in my drive here. And we're gonna see a balloon pop up right here. And it's gonna say uh, any DVD is scanning the disk. Yep. Now see what what any DVD does is that it pretty much makes the disk copy backable. Uh, without any DVD, you wouldn't be able to back up the disk. And looks like we're done. Go ahead and close that. Uh, but yeah, it, you can get that from uh, Slysoft, which is the same place you can get the program we're going to use to burn it called Clone DVD. Now, I actually have uh, paid for this. It's a very good program uh, for backing up DVDs. I highly recommend it. Okay, so I want to do a 1-1 one -one copy. I'm going to click this. Okay. I'm going to select this and find the video TS folder. Oops. Backing up Prometheus. Okay. Now, it's asking me if if I want to what type of DVD uh, I want to use right here. Do I want to use a dual layer or a single layer? If I use dual layer, it's going to just make a 1 1 copy, no transcoding involved. If I do a DVD 5, it's going to give me 59% video quality and there is going to be transcoding involved which means it's going to take longer to burn the DVD <clears throat> and what transcoding is is taking the DVD and shrinking it down so it fits on the DVD file uh, I am actually going to head and go and do the uh, DVD 5 because I don't know if this movie is worth a dual layer I haven't seen it. Um, I just said, hey, fuck it, I'm going to buy it. <laughs> uh, so, I'm going to do the DVD 5. I got a, uh, I think I got more DVD 5, uh, single layer DVDs than I do dual layer DVDs anyway. So, now it's scanning for the uh, audio and subtitle settings. You can take subtitles out if you want. Um, but I leave them in, you know, just because, I don't know, I mean, I could, I could take them out, but, you know, I pretty much want a 1-1 one -one copy, so I leave them in. And I always burn at 4X, um, I think the max the discs are, is, uh, can do is 8X, but I do it 4X, and I've been getting, you know, pretty good results. Um, the DVD media I use varies, Kodak, Memorex, uh, TDK, uh, I think there's like one or two more that I use, Philips, um, and I try to use uh, DVD plus R discs, but not necessarily better than DVD dash R discs. Um, I've used both and I really can't tell the difference between a DVD dash R and a DVD plus R as far as like image quality goes watching a movie. <clears throat> uh, of course then you know I've got an old school TV. Alright so we're going to uh, go ahead and click go right here. Watch the little sheep eat the popcorn. And it's basically going to copy the DVD for me. Now it's probably going to take a minute to uh, copy it. So I'm going to pause this and come back when it's like close to being done because that would just, you know, waste time in the fucking video. So I'll be right back. Alright, people, <clears throat> I am back. And we're at 98% of the reading, transcoding, whatever you want to call it. 
and we're almost done here. And once this is done, um, I want to talk just briefly about uh, any DVD here. And it looks like this will be done in 17 seconds. <clears throat> and here we go. Yep, there we go. Okay. So, uh, any DVD, um, it's, an, it's a great program. I highly recommend buying it along with Clone DVD here. You can get it at sliceoff.com. I'll put the link in the description. Um, it, it does a lot of different things. Um, I'm not going to, you know, go into all of it, but it'll also do, uh, I think, image files. Yeah, rip uh, d video DVD to hard disk. <coughs> rip to image, yep. So it'll do that. It's pretty awesome. Um, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and insert my uh, DVD here and let it start. My blank DVD is what I meant. There we go. Put that in there. And it'll start writing. And it takes about, I don't know, 30 or so minutes to write. Uh, that's depending on your DVD speed, your DVD writer speed. <clears throat> and that's about it. Uh, that's how easy it is. It's uh, very, very easy. Um, any questions, comments, feel free to, you know, ask them or uh, why not. All right, later, guys. Today's DVD backup was brought to you by the letter L and the number 7. Thank you for watching.